first time ever, Aurora Police Department releasing a report that's all about how often officers are now using force. And it shows the number of deadly incidents involving police is significantly decreasing. Matt Morrow here to walk us through this. Matt. Well, Jeremy and Talia, it's a very in-depth report that goes into a lot of detail about Aurora Police back in 2023, including how often they use force and what level of force they use. Some of the takeaways here, lethal uses of force are down significantly, while the rest are up significantly. So take a look right here. Back in 2023, Aurora Police had 757 use of force reports. Officers used force in about 11% of their arrest. Overall, that's less than half of a percent of all the calls for service in the city. These percentages are fairly consistent with the two years prior. Now take a look at this. You can see the levels of force that officers used. An overwhelming majority are considered low level. They're designed to control people who are resisting and not necessarily hurt them. Think of a take down technique. 16% of instances are considered intermediate where suspects are likely to be hurt. This includes getting tased or bitten by a canine and a total of four less than half a percent are lethal force. This could include that police kill someone such as a case where they fire a weapon. For a little perspective in that category, there were 13 lethal reports a year before. The deputy chief tells me this is due to a number of factors. Aurora police have more non-lethal tools now, including a baton launcher that can be used from a distance so police do not have to get up close to suspects who are volatile. Plus, there's more and different training, including some with paid actors. So that officers find themselves, even in a scenario, even in training, those are really stressful events. We're doing it in front of their peers, in front of training staff, and really trying to work through those problems in a real life, as real life of a situation as we possibly can. Aurora's use of force report also shows a significant jump in the number of arrests in 2023 from the years before that. The deputy chief tells me it's because the department was still getting back to normal after the pandemic when jails were full and police were not making as many arrests for lower level crimes.